We've all heard that laughter is the best medicine. So what better medicine to have right here at home than a comedy festival? I'm going to introduce you right now to Brian Dean who, well, Brian, this festival is part of the whole Burlington downtown experience. Absolutely, it's our second annual Burlington Comedy Festival. Uh, it takes place from Sunday, February 26th through to uh, Wednesday, March 1st with over 12 comics. And this, this festival actually appeals to everyone. It isn't specific to a gender, age, or anything. It's for the entire population. Yes. Well, last year was our first outing, so we saw people of all different types and stripes, if you will. We branched out a little bit this year to make sure that we have family-friendly variety show comedy, but it is largely intended for a mature audience. Let's start with what happens on Sunday. Sure. Sunday at the Burlington Performing Arts Centre, I think it's a two o'clock start time, we have three amazing variety performers. They include a Guinness World Book record uh, holder for a yo-yo champion. We have a guy on a unicycle who can juggle and we also have a female sword swallower, among others. So all of these things are happening at the Burlington Performing Arts Centre and there is a ticket price for each one of the uh, evenings or the days that this is happening. Are people going to get their tickets at the venues or all at one place? Um, almost all the tickets are sold online. And just to be clear, only half of the shows are at the Burlington Performing Arts Centre. The other half are right here, one of my favourite restaurants downtown. Um, there will be some tickets sold uh, at the door, but based on last year's performance, uh, I would not recommend that because we had some sellouts. And of course, the restaurant you're talking about is the Water Street Cooker. And Craig, you have a really excellent opportunity for people to um, get a little Water Street Cooker food, Emma's Back Porch food, and have entertainment. That's, uh, that's true. So uh, our participation in the uh, second annual Burlington Comedy Fest, we're excited to be actually a partner this year and sponsor. And uh, we're excited to see the program grow. Uh, true to what Brian said, the variety show Sunday at the Performing Arts Centre, and then two uh, nights we turn our lovely Water Street Cooker Dinner House into a dirty little comedy club. <laughs> and uh, the best way to take advantage of that is a, a program uh, that we created was the Food and Funny Deal. And that Food and Funny Deal basically includes your ticket price, it includes a $25 gift card to be spent at the restaurant that day, and it includes reserved seating, which uh, last year, and as Brian mentioned, uh, the tickets uh, went fast. Uh, we hosted uh, three separate evenings last year, this year just two, and uh, the, we turned uh, every little possible space into seating to watch uh, these great comedians, great quality comedians, and uh, we think the best way is to come on down early, enjoy some of our, uh, of our great offerings, both in Emma's, there'll be Water Street features because the Water Street will be closed for the comedy performances and uh, to enjoy the Food and Funny Deal. Mm -hmm. And uh, you can find that on the, the BPAC website. You can find it on our website to direct you. Uh, you can find that on the Burlington Downtown website. The Food and Funny Deal, best deal in town. <laughs> Laughs, food, <laughs> friends, <laughs> and downtown. And the Food and Funny Deal is how much? $54, and that includes I mean, that's the full ticket price. Yeah. Right, and then you can enjoy a few drinks during the comedy show up here at the Water Street Cooker. Where, where are we located? We are downtown Burlington on Old Lakeshore Road 2084, just steps away from Brant Street and uh, downtown. And there's parking across the street. Parking across the street. Oh. And uh, we hope, uh, hope to see you. Yeah. Okay, and Brian, it's yes. all going to finish back at the Performing Arts Center. Correct. On what day? On Wednesday, March 1st. What we have is the best of the fest. There will be, I believe, nine comics coming. So you get a chance to see some of them throughout the week at different venues. And it's headlined by Deborah De Giovanni, who many of us know is sort of a national comedic treasure. So all of the all of the uh, comedians who are coming to town are those that you would see in Just for Laughs yes. or any of the other festivals. This is a huge deal. So you, if you are itching for a little laugh, on a cold winter's evening, why not come out and enjoy, well, a good belly laugh and a few drinks and a lot of time with your family and your friends. For Halton Insider, I'm Deb Timstra.